The Long Way to a Small, Angry Planet is a character-driven science fiction novel that delves into the lives and relationships of a diverse crew aboard the Wayfarer, a tunneling spacecraft that creates wormhole-like tunnels between points in space. The story is set in a future where various species coexist and collaborate across the galaxy, forming a complex society known as the Galactic Commons, GC. The crew of the Wayfarer is as varied as the species of the galaxy itself. Captain Ashby Santoso is a human trying to run his business while adhering to his values. Sissix is a reptilian Andrisk pilot whose culture embraces physical closeness and affection. Rosemary Harper is a new clerk with a troubled past she's trying to outrun, using this journey as a chance to start afresh. Kizzy and Jenks are the techs who keep the ship running, both humans but vastly different in personality, with Kizzy's boundless energy balancing Jenks' more grounded nature. Lovey, short for Lovelace, is the ship's AI who harbors deeper feelings for Jenks. Dr. Chef, a grum, acts as the ship's medic and cook, bearing the burden of being one of the last of his species. Corbin, an abrasive algaeist whose job is pivotal in fueling the ship, has difficulty fitting in with the rest. And lastly, Ohan, the cyanat pair, are a duo consisting of an individual and a symbiotic virus, collectively performing the complex calculations necessary for space tunneling. The Wayfarer takes on a lucrative contract that will require traveling to a distant and contentious part of the galaxy. The small, angry planet, Hedra Ka, is home to the Torimi Ka, a warlike species that has only recently and tentatively been exposed to the GC. The job is to construct a wormhole tunnel to the system, which would take over a year of travel to reach. Throughout their journey to Hedra Ka, the crew faces various challenges and adventures that deepen their bond and reveal more about their individual lives. Rosemary's secret, that she is the daughter of a man who committed horrendous crimes, is eventually disclosed, placing her and the crew in a moral quandary. However, rather than being turned away or judged harshly, she finds understanding and acceptance from her crewmates. The novel explores the theme of family and belonging in multiple ways. Sissix's encounter with her kin and the Andres culture reminds her of the values and warmth she left behind, while it exposes the rest of the crew to different familial structures and social norms. Lovey's yearning to be more human-like and her romance with Jenks illuminate the nature of consciousness and raise philosophical questions about what it means to be alive and loved. Jenks desperately wants to give Lovey a body so they can be together in a more physical sense, but the opportunity conjures complex dilemmas revolving around identity and personhood, both for Lovey and for the crew who have to adjust to a new dynamic on board. Dr. Chef recounts the tragic history of his species and his decision to live his remaining days in the service of others, offering a perspective on genocide and survival. The team's cohesion is tested when they arrive at a space station, and Kizzy is kidnapped by a group of Eluans, another sentient species. Their rescue mission brings the crew closer, showcasing their dedication to one another. Ohan's trajectory is one of the most complex as they grapple with the Sienat pair's understanding of their purpose and existence, challenging the crew's moral and ethical beliefs, especially when the question of curing Ohan of their symbiont arises, wherein the crew must confront the concepts of free will and destiny. As the crew reaches the Torimi-controlled space, tensions escalate. During the mission, they encounter violence and hostility, which leads to a harrowing experience that changes the Torimi's perception of the outsiders. This culminates in a storyline that highlights negotiation, diplomacy, and the fragile nature of interstellar politics. In the end, their mission accomplished lays the foundation for future journeys and forges a deeper bond among the crew members. Personal growth, mutual respect, and the embrace of diversity are the narrative's key takeaways. The Long Way to a Small, Angry Planet is more than just a space adventure tale. It is a profound exploration of identity, relationships, and the myriad forms that home can take. Through the lens of science fiction, Becky Chambers weaves a compelling narrative that celebrates the beauty of inclusivity and the strength found in unity amidst diversity. With a focus on personal stories rather than intergalactic battles or complex sci-fi technology, the novel delivers a heartfelt look at the complexities of life, whether on Earth or light years away among the stars. 
You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.